Hi guys. So this is the shira or the sweet topping that we will make for our dumplings. So it's six tablespoons full of sugar with water and some vanilla flavoring and saffron or saffron there you go little bit of saffron this will impart the color and the specific taste and vanilla essence or vanilla powder vanilla extract would be better but this suffices so you just stir it for five minutes and it's done okay so it takes around six to seven minutes the sugar dissolves quickly and then it becomes a bit sticky so by uh, just like the consistency of uh, uh, honey it's coming to a boil maybe a couple of boils and it is done and this will be drizzled over the freshly fried dumplings Look at that consistency. Okay, just switch that off. Okay. So here you guys see this is the batter. It is pale yellow color. So this is homemade batter. So it is uh, one cup of all purpose flour. Okay. A pinch of salt, two tablespoons of sugar, one tablespoon of regular custard powder, ishvi bad. Okay. So there is uh, some uh, a teaspoon full of yeast. You keep it aside, and it raises. And now we are going to make these small balls for the dumplings. Okay. That's to check if the oil is heated up or not yet. Okay. So that is the batter. Okay, so you moisten your fingers with oil and form them into bowls. Tiny bowls and then drop them into bubbling hot oil. So they come out nice, rounded, crispy. They are supposed to be golden brown. You can make them in badges as our maid is going to do that. There you go, she dips her fingers in oil. And the dumplings are taking their shape. It doesn't matter, they don't have to be round. They taste good anyways. Mm. 
دے ڈونٹ ٹیک مچ ٹائم کم لگے گا تقریباً کم سا لگے گا سو دے آر فرائڈ ٹو گولڈن براؤن کلر ود ان فائیو منٹس وی ول کنٹینیو ٹو سی دی پریپریشن سو اٹ از اسٹکی ڈو اینڈ یو سی دی ڈو ہیز ریزن کوائٹ اے بٹ اینڈ یو کین سی آل دوز ٹائنی چیز کیکس holes I will write the recipe as well so you guys can try this at home this is a real good simple cooking it takes no more than 15 minutes to fry and serve The heat doesn't need to be very high. The oil is not smoking. So just give them a stir. Needs to be only golden brown. so that they take a good color but remember the smaller tastes better they are more crispier than the bigger ones because still from inside they will be mushy lugay mat or gay mat the dumplings now i'll show you when they are done so you see they have started to change their color now from yellow to golden keep on stirring them so that they get their color all around i know some of you guys will be complaining that everything is fried but you need to try this it's yummy i can eat this whole batch they are fluffy crispy from outside and tender from inside in jeevi han jeev shu oh that's right moisten your hand with oil regular oil this is the other way شوئی شوئی ہی نہیں شوف مرتا نہیں اوکے سو ہول دی ڈو ان یور ہینڈ اسکویز اٹ آؤٹ بٹوین دی تھم اینڈ یور انڈیکس فنگر اینڈ دین یو کین جسٹ سلائس اٹ آف ود اے اسپون ٹی اسپون اینڈ سی ہاؤ راؤنڈ اینڈ بیوٹیفل دے کم آؤٹ سو جسٹ ڈیپ دی اسپون اینڈ یور ہینڈ ان آئل اینڈ دے کم آؤٹ بیوٹیفلی لک ایٹ دس They come out like balls. Ping pong balls, I mean. It's the same size, actually. We have removed the pot of the fire because the oil is quite hot enough. Have a look at how she is doing it. Dip it in oil, squeeze it between your hand, and there it goes. Almost perfect ping pong size balls. Same size always. This is the other way. I think this way is easier.
and the rest goes back on the flame again. Remember to stir them so that they get colored all over. So these perfect bowls have started to get color sooner. So they are in the pan, I think, so now three minutes. And they are almost done. That's the syrup, golden syrup, and we are going to add the logemat or gemat to that. So you see it's like one fourth or even less. The syrup just has to coat it because the logemat are slightly salty and sweet and they have to be topped up with the syrup. And then they are placed in a platter and presented. I will show you how that's done as well. Baskalas. Okay. So you can cook them in batches, the fresh, the better. So they can stay out, remember one thing, they can stay out for four to six hours crispy. If you cover them up, they will become mushy, okay? From ping pong bowls, they will become like tennis bowls. So, so the best idea is to keep them crisp, don't cover them slightly glazed and they taste yummy. Let's see how they taste when we have our start. Yeah, okay guys, so these are the dumplings. Gonna give them a try. So they are crispy from outside and doughy from inside. They are similar to those bite-sized donuts by Dunkin' Donuts. Look at that. They taste gorgeous. I'm gonna finish up all of these. Thumbs up, like and subscribe. Tell me what should I post next. Until next time, Shabakhair, bye bye.